This is a quick video to show you how my helper for Tasmata works in a browser. It's installed as a bookmarklet, which is outlined in the README. I've just configured this new device as a tour device. So we've clicked on the bookmarklet and you can see all of the tour device IDs listed there. I can turn these on and start changing the settings and I can see what happens on my device. As I click on for each of these, I can see that the switches are turning on. So I'm gonna configure all of these as relays one through to four. As I do that, you see all of the commands that will be sent to the device appear down the bottom. We can click on send command and that will go ahead and configure the device as per the drop downs we've selected. We can now test things again to make sure it's all working as expected. I'll try flipping those off and we can see it turns off and it's, the uh, state is reflected in the interface as expected. And if we go back to the home page, we can then turn things on and off. We can see the four, four devices there and it's all working as I would expect. So let's now go and configure the rest of the settings on this device. I know this device has power monitoring and I can see the numbers that are constantly changing down the bottom. I do know the power usage of my device and which one's likely to be voltage based on the documentation. So here I'm just going to select all of the settings. I know it's a uh, 13 watt bulb and from that I configure the power and the current and I know roughly what volt my line voltage is. So again we send that command through and we can see everything's configured uh, and then we again we have the commands down the bottom if we want to configure another device like this. I now also try some of the other uh, settings and see what they do. I've just put in some random numbers in here and I can see these are counting down and then once these countdowns hit zero, it toggles the state of the device. So those other fields are apparently built-in timers in the MCU. We won't be using these, but at least I know what they are. Once I've done that, I can now go back to the main menu, check things are still working as expected, and I can also see that the power usage settings are coming up as expected when I turn things on. The current and voltage is increasing. Hope you enjoy.